I beseech thee to answer my call. Well, that's bad. <laughs> Hey there, YouTube Basics. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, hi, I'm Basic With Girl, and this is our react along to Netflix's new delicious and dungeon anime. This is episode nine, which I believe is titled, hold on, I'm just gonna look it up really quick. Uh, tentacles. Ten tentacles and stew. Tasty. Uh, we last left off with a really great, I think that episode eight has been my favorite so far, reflecting on everything that we've encountered while we're down here in the dungeon with our little gang gang group. Uh, episode eight provided a really, really great insight to Marcel and Fallon's relationship, which if you guys have been paying attention, if you've been watching my react series, you know that I've loved Marcel like this entire time. I love an elf who does magic. What can I say? But it really provided such a great insight to their friendship, their relationship, and maybe why some of the people in the group are willing to go this extra mile in order to save her. Uh, the episode wrapped up with another group, kind of, it looked like maybe approaching and uh, we will we'll see how that might play out. If you are new here and you haven't done so already, please make sure that you hit the subscribe button and turn on your bell notifications so that you get alerted to when new episodes of the React series or any of the first playthroughs that we do here on the channel go live. We do a lot of different things here. We do a lot of first playthroughs of story-driven RPGs, and and we also we we also do the reacts over on Twitch. We do cooking streams. We do games. We do a whole bunch of stuff as well. So that's my spiel. Let's get into the. Uh, I was gonna say into the game, but it's not a game. Let's get into the. Uh, let's get into the episode. Oh yeah, Marcel. So they were eating the. Um, they're eating the kelpie. Can't believe it. Uh -oh. Someone really is grilling meat. Okay, so right away, this other group is stumbling upon us. <laughs> We're not looking for a fight here. Uh, I know that voice. <gasps> oh! Hey, uh, don't push yourself. If you kick the bucket, Fallon would be sad. Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, yes. We'd like to request their assistance. What's your offer? Dinner? We've got food. Some Kelpie meat? Hell no. Ah. Uh. There's an Undine up ahead, so maybe you should stay here. Is there now? Who is this guy? You all went and angered it, did you? Um. <laughs> we'll be just fine. All right. Have lived amongst the spirits since ancient times. All right, have fun. <laughs> Go ahead. So there is nothing to be afraid of. Okay. Go for it. Have fun. I beseech thee to answer my call. Well, that's bad. <gasps> what? How could you let this happen? She'll be all right. You're off our rain, Barete, rain. Oh, so he's the healer. He's the healer and he just won't heal Marcel. Ugh. The dead shouldn't come back to life. Well, that ain't normal. Ain't nothing normal about it. Ooh, I wonder if we're gonna get some like, some background on how everyone's died. The way I see it is, it's not that the dead are coming back to life. It's that death itself is forbidden inside this place. This is just the type of ancient sorcery that I research. Can you help Marcel? <laughs> Can you help Marcel? If you agree to assist me, I will heal your friend in return. Namari is going to be upset. Mm. I don't like this guy. I don't like this guy. No frightening, huh? So ugly and difficult to read. <gasps> That's mean. As for you, that axe, you need to take better care of it. It looks horrible. <laughs> When it comes to handling weapons, there's no one I trust more than you.
Uh oh. Uh oh. Then how are you certain something is there? I just do. You must be joking. Sir, when Lyo starts acting like this, I think we should trust him. <laughs> if it's hiding, we'll just drag it out. Okay, good luck. Go Kiki and Kaka, have fun. What are you two oh. doing? Hurry up and kill this! Now I know which one Kiki is, I guess. I will revive you if that happens. Shut the hell up! Fine. I'm going in. Senshi, can I borrow your helmet? <gasps> oh! He's... Oh! Senshi's face! The thing I'm putting my trust into here is you and Senshi. Huh? What's that mean? Reach me. <laughs> I guess it still stings through armor, huh? Ooh! Even so. What are you doing up there? Aim for its torso, you idiot! No, he knows so much. Damn it! So that's what he meant. Yeah, sure. Give me the toughest job. Oh please! There we go. Tentacles. Lyos, you doing okay? Sure doesn't look like it. What happened? Show us his face! Hang on, I'm going to heal you now. He better have enough magic. This is a tough one. Uh-oh! Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> what the hell happened to your face? I got stung <laughs> by tentacles. <laughs> Oh, lips, dude. Why are you still holding it? It's Danner! Rinsing with vinegar helps subdue the nidocytes' barbs. Although, depending on the species, it could have the opposite effect, so be careful. <laughs> the outer skin of the nidocyte. And it's like a banana! <laughs> Apparently, it's tasty. Are you making a joke? No. Better once cooked properly. Let me have a taste, too. <laughs> I think the taste differs in each spot. He must be a. <laughs> She's probably so confused. Why they're just eating monsters all of a sudden? Try some from this spot right here. No, I'm fine, really. We're plenty stocked on food, so I'll pass. But it tastes good. It doesn't. It doesn't, he says. <laughs> it's your turn. Fantastic. Though. So could you start with her first? Please? Yay. You healed me. Thank you so much. And you too, Lyle. <laughs> we would have been boned if you weren't so good at using crossbows. Actually, it was my first time touching one. Wow. The whole Fallon thing aside, you did help us out. So thank you for that. She's gonna yell at her. Uh-oh. Mm. Hey, come on, you two. <laughs> He's still all swollen. That's not what I meant. You're there, leader. Seems unpleasant. <laughs> Send she for leader. I'd vote for Senshi to be the leader. Senshi for king of the castle. King of the dungeon. From what I remember, a spirit's lifespan is about one week. A whole week, huh? We can't wait that long. Oh. What are you gonna do? But why now? I don't get it. Look, your mana's currently depleted. And I hear that's like having anemia for magic users. So you should go back with Mr. Tansu. I'm fine, though. <laughs> How come there's no mana running through your staff like usual? Oh, this? Hang on. <laughs> you can't fight a dragon with only three people. Namari. Namari, you gotta join the party. So, if she rejoins her former party to make a quick buck, she'll gain a reputation as someone who will do anything you ask her to if you pay her enough. It's best for everyone if you give up on trying to get her to return. 
You should go back too. I can recover my mana, and I'm going to use the Undine to do it. Huh? How so? I'll catch it and drink it! <gasps> what? <laughs> then, after we attack it and it splatters onto the floor, I'll slurp it all up! <laughs> Punch holes in your body from the inside? Yeah, you're right. Oh pan and use it as a shield then we can attack and defend that spirit destroyed stone pillars what's a shoddy pan gonna do how dare you call it shoddy how dare this color this shine this weight this feel it's adamantine isn't it Ooh! why was it turned into a pan it started as a shield but it was useless to me like that know more about Shinshi's like past and his family though if he just has adamantine like that it's so powerful uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh Lios! <laughs> Navari The heat up they are going to get their hands burnt <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> are you okay their stature would make you think otherwise but tall men are actually weak <laughs> Let's see. I want to make sure I absorb the spirit's mana. Don't you know? <laughs> Eating foods that help with absorption is the basics of nutrition. What are we? Tentacle? Let's get cooking. Yeah! Potatoes, carrots, onion. I can make a soup. Salt and pepper the kelpie meat. Like a beef stew. It's ready! <laughs> Yum! Stew, a tentacle, and kelpie. They went on over to the other tower to examine it. We're back! <laughs> um, hey. Look like at Jill Chuck. Like to eat with us? Sharing a meal! <laughs> Yay, it's working. A little bit of my mana came back. Keep eating. I really want to become a member of your party. I promise to do my best. Cute. I still don't I'm like surprised. that gnome I thought guy, though. you be the first to leave the group for sure. <gasps> Listen, Marcel, here's something you should know. Anybody who tells you they don't need a reward are honestly the people you should trust the least. Interesting. Seemed like he had some other plans cooked up. He was so in love with Fallon, he wanted to propose. <laughs> but I hope you make it back okay. Well, she's not gonna say, uh, same to you, Namari. See ya. Cute, cute. Episode nine. I just, man, it's so refreshing to watch something like this that, for the most part, has been so like feel good 
like obviously the situation is less than ideal with the whole uh Fallon being eaten by the dragon and it's like a very important thing to obviously so many people in the group but every episode has just got so much like little bits of character development and like little insight to the characters and it's just so 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 good I like that we got to see a perspective from somebody who left the party at the very beginning I know um last episode that Marcel was kind of reflecting on now currently being the only girl in the group and like just you know feeling a little bit of an outsider in that way and having that flashback to Namari and the other um the other person in the party like leaving and kind of uh you know feeling a little bit abandoned by that so totally understandable that she kind of she she held a little bit of anger, a little bit of hostility, resentment, but the fact that they're all able to talk through it, understand each other a little bit better, share a meal, and then like go their separate ways with no hard feelings. And then knowing that it wasn't personal, that there's a lot of factors at play uh, when it comes to why everybody is uh, doing this adventuring. So um, another really, really, really fantastic episode. If you guys made it to the end of the react, thank you so much for being here. We are getting closer and closer to, I believe episode 10 is another lead up. And then 11 and 12 are actually getting to the dragon. Um, try not to look too far ahead, but I did notice that when I was sitting down to look at the episode titles. Um, so we are like, we are so close to this penultimate kind of confrontation we've been working towards um and i i'm super excited to see what happens what happens to our group what the results are and um see see how that ends i know there's episodes afterwards too and that it doesn't just end with this uh this little this big uh confrontation with the dragon so um really really excited if you guys made it to the end of the video though thank you so much for watching again i'm basic with girl and um thank you so much for your time we'll see you guys in the next one have a good one <laughs>